What up Ninja Clan and welcome back to our YouTube channel. I am, as always, your host, the Atomic Ninja G, and today we are taking on the final member of the BB League's uh, Elite Four. So here is the team. This is the team we're taking in. We're taking in Pyro, we're taking Charizard, Metagross, Magma, Rhydon, and Hitmonchan. Hitmonchan and uh, Rhydon and Metagross are there purely to take on anything that might counter fire. Metagross, I've just realized, is actually a steel Pokemon, right? Yep, so if they pull out a fire Pokemon to take on my fire Pokemon, um, that could be a problem. But we're gonna go with it anyway. Uh, they've all got the one berry that if they uh, they survive and they get eat the berry, they get HP back. Um, and as you can see, Magma's on 92. I've got higher level 80s. These two uh, are lower levels because I caught them last, and that's how that works. Um, so let's stop faffing around and get right to it. Let's talk to you about the Elite Four training, uh, not trial, not training. Welcome to the Canyon Plaza. We're the team that supports Amorous of the Elite Four. And you're G, right? One of the BB League challengers? That's right. I'm here for your badge. You'll need to hand over 50 BP if you want to take on the Elite Trial. Yep, that's fine. Let's -a go. I'm really, really close to that 3,000 and opening up um, some more starters. Very excited for that. Thank you very much. Duly received and noted. Now here she comes. Our very own Amorous. Gee, yes. As you see, I'm present and ready for your trial. A change of location is required. Come. She's very efficient, isn't she? No faffing around with this lady. Oh. Okay, so what we have to do, we've made a sandwich, we've done other stuff, what have we got to do for this ridiculous trial? The decision to allow you to take on the league was irregular, an exception among exceptions. I was against it, as you know, but the academy allowed it, and their ruling is absolute. Therefore, I will carry out my duty as a member of the Elite Four as flawlessly as I always do. The Elite Trial I devised starts right here. I call my challenge the Flying Time Trial. Oh no, I'm rubbish at time trials. You will need to fly around the skies of the Terrarium while riding a Pokemon. Reach the goal within the prescribed time and you will pass the trial. Fly through the Magmite rings and extra time will be added to the countdown. I recommend you go through as many rings as possible as you fly towards the goal. Oh, great. Can you verify that you are ready and willing to take on my flying time trial? I am ready. Let us go. Understood. I assume you have a Pokemon to ride on. Please bring it out of its bowl. I assume we're gonna have to choose Moridon. Yes, we do. Okay. Yes! Ah, good. With some effort, this Pokemon should be capable of flight. The name is Agias, yes? This is for you to eat. What? Chomp chomp, snarf chomp. Okay, so does this mean I'll be able to fly from now on? Yes! Maraidon is brimming with power. I'm really hoping it's not a temporary thing. What your Agias just consumed is a supplement that enhances a Pokemon's flight capabilities. I prepared it using the leaves of a mysterious plant that was found growing in the terrarium. Ooh, maybe it's more Herba Mystica. Your Agias will be able to soar through the skies as it pleases, but only for the duration of the trial. Boo! Okay, try to reach the goal within the time limit by flying on Maridon's back. Passing through Magnemite rings will grant you extra time. We knew this. You can fly freely in any direction using the left stick. Move the left stick up to fly up, down to move down, move the left stick left or right to change direction. Okay. You have all you need to begin the challenge. 
I wish you luck. Let's go. Let's see what Maraidon's like when it flies. See what I'm like when I fly. Good grief. This could take several attempts, guys. I'm honestly, I'm rubbish at this kind of stuff. I'm, I'm really bad at flying stuff. I'm so bad. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Du, 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 du. And that one. Oh, no, no, no. Ah! Oh, don't, 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 oh, I missed it. I don't have to get those rings, right? I wish there was a way I could control my speed. Dive, dive, dive. Whoop, whoop. Oh, no, I missed it. I missed it. Okay, that's fine. Ah! Up, 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 up. Yes! Oh, is this the goal? Is this it? Is this it? Yay! That wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad at all. I wonder if you could just, like, literally fly straight from one thing to the other. That was an impressive display of punctuality. I must admit, it was satisfying to watch you fly. Congratulations, you have cleared my elite trial. Thanks. Now a change of location is required once again. Come. Alright, let's go. Oh, here we are. Here we go. You've earned the right to face me in battle. Do you wish to begin? Yes. Understood. Let's assume our battle positions. Position assumed. <laughs> funny old bean, isn't she? There is one thing I wanted to ask you. It concerns Kiran. What is he to you, G? Arch nemesis. So, you consider him a worthy adversary. I see. I wouldn't say worthy, he's just a pain in the butt. For my part, Kiran is the younger brother of my dear friend Carmine. Something in him has changed. He is not his usual self. I find this deeply concerning. If possible, I want to be able... If possible, I want to be the one to help him. That being the case, I cannot afford to lose. Okay, our battle starts now. I should have made a German. <laughs> You're challenged by Amulets of the BB League Elite Four. All right, so we've got a Skarmory. Oh, we've got, okay. A Doug Trio. It's in the low hand form. Get ready, Skarmory, you too, Dugtrio, we're finishing the battle on schedule. Uh, right, we're going to use Incinerate, because that gets rid of any berries or anything they may have. And we're going to use Sunny Day. We're going to see... Uh, doesn't affect Skarmory. Doesn't affect Charizard, it will affect Pyro. Ooh! Oh, yeah, of course, we have berries. I forgot about that. Hey! <laughs> okay. We lose incinerate. So any berries they may have are also gone. So they don't have any berries or items. That's great. An unforgettable... An unforgivable type map. Okay. Two cast. Okay. Sunlight turned harsh. So we are going to... Oh, he's gone now. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's sad. Uh, right. Let's use Rhydon then. Because he has things that will really help against Doug Trio. Okay. We'll use Arm Hammer. Because I don't want to use... 
Uh, she's fire spinning him. I should have given Charizard like a flamethrower or something. I really should have. Super effective, yep. Yeah. Okay, Charizard just fire spin. It avoided the attack. Bother. Bother, bother, bother. Okay, so we can't swap out. Ooh, if this goes to round two, I need to change Charizard's moves, because yet again, I have completely forgotten to do that before we started the match. Okay. He's gone. At least that much is true. Uh, tangling here. His speed falls. Okay, that's fine. It's still gone. Right, what else is coming up? That's a water Pokemon! That is a straight up water Pokemon. Alright. We need to get rid of this guy right now. That's Piplup's evolution, right? That is straight. I was not expecting a straight up water Pokemon. Although we do have Hitmonchan. Oh no! Ah, oh, boo! Okay, Hitmonchan is going to come and deal with Imperion. Because we have Thunder Punch. Okay, run across. Oh, she is throwing out Pokemon I wasn't expecting at all. That's not steel. Okay, dokey. Uh, yeah. Let's just straight up Thunder Punch. Um, and. Let's air slash, because that's no longer not effective. Mm, not great. Okay. Uh, Thunder Punch. Super effective. Yep, but not effective enough. So it's Hydro Pump on Charizard. Yep, I mean, it makes sense. And he's going to eat his berry. Om nom 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 nom. The Charizard is still in for at least one more round. Uh, depends on what this thing does. Trick Room switches attack and defense, right? Something like that. Okay. What's it doing now? Using leftovers. Oh, now I wish I had Pyro. Um, hmm. It's not very effective. It's super effective against something. Uh, do you know what? No, let's just stick with the uh, Thunder Punch. Um, and... Let's use that against him. He's psychic. He's gonna go first. Charizard. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's sad. Okay. Use Hydro Pump. Hopefully, hit my chance gonna take this. Yeah. Like a champ. Thunder punch him in the face. Oh. Not quite enough. Sunlight faded. Okay, I was expecting something with, um, is that all I've got left? Right, this is Metagross. Um, I was expecting something with water type moves, but I was not expecting a straight up water Pokemon. Okay, so, first things first, let's use a Drain Punch on him. And then what I'm going to do is start reviving some stuff. So let's revive Pyro, get that sunny day back in action. Um, and that's a starter Pokemon, so she, I think, has just used the starter Pokemon. Because they all come with a starter Pokemon. Oh no! Oh no! Oh wait! Oh, bother, is it? Yes, yeah, because he's fighting. Oh, this is not good. This is not good at all. Man! Right, okay. I'm gonna risk it with Pyro, right? Because I want to incinerate stuff. Now, it's going to use. Um. Hydro Pump. Oh, it's a new psychic already? No, please don't take him out. Oh, come on! Yeah, this is so going to round two. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, my days. Right, first is first. I need to change Charizard's moves. Um, and check out all the rest of them. I need to get in um, Pyro on that guy. Because Leftovers needs to disappear. 
Right, let's see what we can do here. Come on, Magma. You I got this. We need to, absolutely need to take out that, um... Empalion. You psychic. My life. These two are going to be a pain in the butt. Okay. And then hopefully we get to go first. No! Okay, speed is an issue here. Speed is an issue. Right. I'm going to go away, guys. And I'll bring you guys right back in for round two. And welcome back, guys. So, for the most part, I reckon Skarmory doesn't really do that much to me. And um, we know that these guys don't have Get Ready Skarmory, U2 Drug Trio. We're finishing this battle right on schedule. Uh, for the most part, uh, these guys don't have any berries or anything like that. So, we can start just taking them out. Uh, Earthquake is going to be a problem. Do I want to use Sunny Day now, or should I use it later? Let's. Let's use it later. Let's just take out Dugtrio. Uh, so we're going to keep Skarmory alive. Um, in all honesty. That, okay, and hopefully Flamethrower goes next. An unfavourable tight matchup. You caught me off guard. Now my glasses can see clearly. Now the rain has gone. <laughs> I don't know. It goes way too fast, some of these things. There we go. Dugtrio is gone. No damage to us. Happy days. And again, Skarmory, not that much of a threat. Uh, the next guy, however, the next guy is threatening all over. So, what I may do is switch out Pyro. Maybe that's what I should have done. Okay, let's switch him out for him. Swap him in. Then we are going to use Sunny Day to dampen down the effects of water attacks. Because the combination of the Empyrean Penguin and the Psychic Guy was horrible. So we're going to keep Skarmory in. Hopefully he's not going to do massive amounts of damage to us. Okay, good. Whirlwind. Not good. What does that do? Oh, come on. Do I get to choose who comes out? No. Who's coming out? Right on. Okay. Not good. Good, but not good at the same time. Because Rhydon is obviously a water Pokemon. Uh, no, it's not a water Pokemon. It's a... Well, let's just blame... How is it effective? It's a water Pokemon. Um, okay. He's uh, he's bad against water. It's water. Oh, yes! It doesn't matter. He's gone. You know what I'm trying to say. He's weak against water. Words are not working in my brain, out of my mouth today, because I'm just very excited about this battle. Okay, let's go. We're going to get rid of him. Now this, but to be honest, so I'm okay with Whirlwind, because it's not actually damaging me. The spikes do. I will say, the spikes do damage me. I'd like Pyro. Nope, Magma. Okay. Magma was dragged out. Who is coming out? Yes, this guy. Right, so I really want Pyro to be in here now. Uh, I'm not going to lie. So we're going to use Mega Horn. And which one does the most? 90, 80, 100. But that's not... Okay, Flamethrower is. Let's turn this thing up. There we go. Hopefully Rhydon goes next. Mega Horn. Boom. Smack it into his face. Ha ha ha. All right. Here's the tactic. Let's keep Starmory in. Because... So bad luck. Can you play a role in battles? What? It's too fast. Okay. He's whirlwind. Who have we got coming out this time? Today's mystery Pokemon is... Oh, Metagross. Okay. Metagross is dragged out. And let's see. Pointed stones dug into Metagross. A Skizo. Okay. That is definitely a steel Pokemon. Um, so, fire is going to be great. Uh, okay, don't want to use Surf. Uh, earthquake, will that affect him? Yes, it will. So, Arm Hammer, it is. Uh, do I have anything? Ooh, the Punch. Oh, because he's flying. But he's not a threat. This is the thing, right? He's not a threat. So, we're going to... 
Yeah, he's not a threat. <laughs> so we're going to keep on the ones that I don't know yet. Trailblaze. Ooh, that's super effective. Uh, he may take his berry now. Yeah, here we go. All right. I guess if you go below half HP, maybe. Uh, restored. Yep. We're going well so far, though. So far, so okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep, yeah, yeah, let's use arm hammer again, and yes, yeah, so this is both both work. Here's right on. Oh, yeah, that's a shame. But now at least I get to choose what comes out next until he will win it out. Um, so I would like a fire Pokemon to come out. Uh, let's use magma, maybe. Oh, well, hang on. Hold the phone. Magma might be coming out anyway. Let's see. Either way, I've got a fire Pokemon coming out. Oh, it's Pyro. Alright, that'll do. That will do Donkey. Okay, sunlight has faded. Um. Uh, super effective, super effective, super effective. Effective. Is there anything here that is super effective that's not... I kind of want to keep him in reserve. Should we just send out Metagross back out? Let's send Metagross back out. Why not? Okay. These spikes are annoying, though. I will say that. Okay. Let's, let's just do everything at him. And then hopefully at least one of them will hit. Oh, he's got a berry. Oh, that's fine. It didn't matter. Was that me eating the berry or did he eat the berry? I think it was him, right? Orca berries used up. Yep. He fainted. Uh, and then what? Uh, what has she got next? Press. Oh, no! I wanted to use incinerate. <laughs> she should be due a terrestrial relation soon. He just brick brick against him. Doesn't do much. That's fine. Oh, Rocky Helmet. Of course. Uh... Have Charizard. Let's get those uh, fire things up and running. Right, what have you got left? She's gonna set a Metagross. Okay. How many Pokemon does she have? This is their last two. So Metagross is going to be. Right, let's Thunder Punch him. She's going to steal it up. So we're gonna use Sunny Day. Time is short. Let's wrap up this battle. Wrap this battle up. I said it right, just in the wrong order. Ha 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 ha. That's is going to become all steel. Right. We can do this. I I'm confident with this one. This as long as I get these two moves off, I'm going to be happy. So sunny day. Good. Excellent. Really hoping to get Thunder Punch in. There we go. Let's get rid of Skarmory. It's effective, but not massively effective. But he is paralyzed. Hip, hip, hooray. Okay. What's Metagross going to do? Rocky Helmet. I may... Ooh, psychic. Yeah. I may revive Pyro just to get rid of items. Because he's got Incinerate. So I think I might actually do that. Oh, Whirlwind. Magma's coming out then, I hope. Uh, and Metagross may come straight back out as well. <laughs> We go, there's magma and oh these spikes how do I get rid of these spikes uh, let's bring out hitman Chan he's gonna get hurt by the spikes uh, okay let's do this I'm gonna leave Skarmory alone I really think I'm going to leave Skarmory alone Let's just get rid of him. Let's get rid of him. In for it. Oh, one shot! Get in! Good job, Magma. Good job. I'm pretty sure Sunny Day really helped with that as well. <laughs> All right, so one more fire punch. Come on, take him out. Let's get rid of this Skarmory. Rocky Helmet. Yeah. 
He's going to whirlwind. Oh, he's going to take a berry. He's probably going to whirlwind out, but it doesn't matter. It is done. It is dusted. This battle is mine. Skarmory is paralyzed. Cannot do a single thing. All right, Magma. Take us home, my friend. Take us. Oh, bother. <laughs> Never mind. Doesn't matter. There we go. Okay, I will officially tell you that this was the easiest battle of all the Elite Four. The most difficult one was Crispin, and the other two were in the middle. Of all of them, obviously they all beat me at least one time, but of the second rounds where I kind of knew what was coming, she was the easiest. I'm not enough, I see. Hot diggity dog! That's all the Elite Four done! Oh woohoo! Just Kieran to go! crush his face into the ground and then I am a happy happy bunny the strength of one's Pokemon reflects the strength of one's beliefs your desire to help Kiran is evidently greater than my own do not do not say that that's not even funny uh, you got that right no you came plenty you came more than I do I want to crush him you want to help him big difference gee you truly are a kind person. <laughs> you obviously can't hear what I just said. <laughs> All right then. Time for a photo. We must ensure that your victory here is properly commemorated. Okay. That is not the kind of photo I was expecting from her. And okay. <laughs> no smile, just a love heart. I will give you this TM too. It contains a favorite move of mine. Hard press. Okay. Didn't see you use it at all, but okay. The target is crushed with an arm, a claw, or the like to inflict damage. The more HP the target has left, the greater the move's power. That is cool. It is up to you to help Kiranji. I entrust my wish to you. I wouldn't. Time for me to go. So long. Okay, and here we go. Grease Lightning's about to appear. Come on, Drayton. Show up. Tell me what it is you want me to do next. There he is. Yo, 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 champ in the making. Guess you're almost a champ in the maid. That's the BB League Elite Four all beaten. You schooled every elite one of us. Amara sure leaves an impression, huh? It's wild seeing her and Carmine talk. You'd never guess it, but they click in a weird way. It's pretty funny to watch. The thing about Amorous is, as rigid, as rigid as she looks, she's got a sensitive streak a mile wide. Remember that about her, okay? Even if it's hard to tell from the outside. Man, it's like I blinked and you'd plowed through the whole BB League. You know what's next for you, right, bud? You're good enough to beat all Elite Four of us. So you, and only you, have the right to challenge the sitting BB League champion, Kieran. And here he is. <clears throat> you really kept me waiting. Took you a while to beat the Elite Four kind of slow for you, isn't it? Nice, Kieran. You've really got G on the brain, huh? I could say the same thing about you, Drayton. You sure are putting a lot of effort into helping G out. Who wouldn't help out a new student? Gotta be good to your fellow humans. That's rich coming from you. Whatever you're planning, it's about to come to an end. Gee. Let's settle who's the strongest between us two. Once and for all. Oh, you're such a brat. It's finally time. I'm pumped for you. We'll have to sign you up to the front desk to get your championship match going. No sense waiting around. Let's go. Oh. So I have to do what you tell me to do? Thanks for that. Because I have plans. That's right. I have plans. Face off against Kieran is the next mission. 
But guys, we're going to do that in the next episode. I'm going to go off. I'm going to try and get a whole bunch more. Pushing the wrong button every single time. I'm going to get a whole bunch more of these BBQs done. Uh, because I want to unlock all those starters. Because I don't know what's going to happen once we beat Kieran. Okay? Um, so I have been 100% avoiding spoilers and all that kind of stuff. So I have no idea what's coming up. Because I like to be surprised in these games. So what I'm going to do is get enough BB points to open up all the biomes. Uh, so I need another 9,000. We're almost there to 3. So I've got om almost halfway. Going to do that. Going to get all those starters. Uh, then we're going to challenge Kidron. Uh, I'm going to train as I'm doing it, obviously. And then we'll challenge Kieran. Because so far, if... I don't know if you guys have noticed this, but something I've noticed is that so far, considering this entire DLC, including the Teal Mask, is called the Mystery of Area Zero, we have done nothing at all in Area Zero. Like, nothing at all. So, I'm assuming that once we beat Kieran, something's going to happen, and we're going to have to go to Area Zero... And there's going to be a whole bunch of other stuff to do. So I kind of want to get done with this area first before I really move on. Um, so that's the plan. So, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, it's been a blast. Hashtag fire pun. <laughs> um, if you've enjoyed this episode, do me a favor. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let's start a conversation. I love talking to you guys. Uh, and I just want to say again, thank you to everyone who does leave comments and sends little messages on socials and stuff like that. If you want to support us even more, then you can head to our Patreon page. The link is in the description below. But until next time, I have been the Atomic Ninja G. You guys have been awesome. And this has been Pokemon The Indigo Disc. And today... We are taking on the final member of the Blueberry Academy Battle League Elite Four. I didn't like how I said Battle Battle League. The Battle League. We're taking on the Battle League. All right, let's go. Ah.